Hi Jules, it's Harry at GC Motors. Just going to do you a quick video of the Porsche 911 Turbo Cabriolet. Um, I just thought I'd start in the showroom and show you a couple of the bits that we've got in at the moment. That one's particularly special, the Aventador SV. Beautiful bit of kit. It's Black Batman's car. My personal favourite, 675 LT. McLaren, beautiful car. Nice Rolls Royce, a few bits there. So this is the showroom jewels. Um, as you probably um, gathered from the email, um, GC Motors, the way that we price and prepare our cars is a little bit unlike anywhere else. Uh, we do price our cars to be the best price in the market for their age, mileage and their specification. Um, and in terms of preparation, we do have our own state-of-the-art body shop on the site which we invested heavily in over a million pounds um, to ensure that our cars come in prepped to a degree that nobody else can match um, so we do guarantee our cars come with no dents no scratches through the paint and no marks to the alloy wheels so the car is in beautiful condition marks on the alloy wheels at all. Plenty left on the discs and pads. The front tyres are almost brand new. So this car, you do have PDK gearbox and Porsche active suspension management, which is especially the active suspension management, that's important on the uh, on the turbos keeping these things in check loads of uh, loads of grip on the tire on the back this one has been debadged on the back which does change the look of it a little bit it looks absolutely beautiful from the rear it does have the light pack as well So the only thing that you ever may find on our cars, Jules, is um, the odd stone chip, which unfortunately you can't wrap a car in bubble wrap. Um, and we're never going to change original paintwork for, you know, one or two very light stone chips. But um, overall condition of this vehicle is fantastic. There is pretty much not a mark on it. It's been very well cared for. Another unmarked alloy wheel there. So that's just a quick overview of the exterior of the car. It's been very well looked after. Then on the interior, beautiful red interior. You have got the Bose sound system in here as well. It's a great sound quality. Oh, so we've got a leaf in there. Maybe not the best day for uh, for. A cabriolet but we've got to make the most of it in this country haven't we so the car has done 18,320 miles on this particular car you do have extendable rear and front spoilers which you may have seen on the on the front with the turbo uh, badging on the front of the um, spoiler and obviously the rear car does need a little bit of fuel but other than that it doesn't want for absolutely anything so on here you've got usual mod cons your nav phone various media inputs you do have a jukebox in here so you can download music directly to the car and then you have got your your normal DAB FM AM sources down here sound and configurations for that then you've got your heated seats and climate control on there. Obviously this car is a Porsche double clutch, it's a PDK gearbox. And then down here you've got Sport, Sport Plus, traction control if you're a nutter. Your spoilers on there and then your stop start. And then you have got your roof functionalities on there as well. You do have Porsche emblems in the mats down there. All of the books present in there, 
car does have Porsche service history. And the back, as you probably expect, doesn't look like it's ever been sat in. Not that you know you can really get anybody full size in these, but four seats is always nice. Roof obviously all working exactly as it should. On the interior, it's really really nice. There's no fraying or any marks on uh, on the bolsters in these seats. Usual places you get wear are absolutely fine. Just show you the driver's seat. So again, no wear or fraying of the stitching on the leather. It's all in really, really nice condition. There's no scuffs or marks along the edge of the door of people feet getting in and out. You do have slightly tinted windows on this as well. It looks absolutely fantastic. Again, thank you very much for your inquiry, Jules. I uh, hope you enjoy the video.